my dear friends welcome to my youtube channel math art studio in this studio today i am going to discuss you about the alternative method of finding the area of a trapezium my dear friend take a sheet of paper like this in this paper uh, draw a trapezium by the method of construction. You do it by the method of construction, draw it accurately. It can have any size and it may be isocellus or whatever. Uh, draw a trapezium. You can draw a trapezium having one right angle in it also. There is the freedom of choice. So in this trapezium, find the midpoint of this non-parallel sides. These two are the parallel sides. This side has the length A and that one has the length B. I'll write it later on, making the sketch over there in the piece of paper. The trapezium is ready. Now, cut out the trapezium. Using this trapezium as a template, you draw the congruent trapezium to this one in the sheet of paper. So these are the vertices. Let us join them in order. This is the trapezium and that fits exactly under that one. Now you name this trapezium A, B, C, D. And the mid parallel will be E, F. And the other height on it from anywhere. This time I am doing it from this point A. So this is the height of the trapezium. And this height is also bisected at this point. And let this point be O. Cut out these two pieces. Now you have two trapeziums and glue one with glue stick and paste it over there. So you paste it here. Okay, this way you paste it. And you have the previous trapezium here, exactly in this way. Now what do you do after this? You add another sheet of paper over here. And fit it this way. This way. And glue it over here. paste it here. What shape is this? So this is the parallelogram. Name this parallelogram GHCF. 
and with this material now we can go for the conclusion here the area of the trapezium trapezium ABCD is equal to area of the parallelogram GHCF area of the parallelogram is base into height that is SC is the base into height is you can take any one of them this one or this one let's write this is OP base of the parallelogram into height these are height you know okay it's like this and this base is the sum of BH plus BC and both of them the sum multiplied by OP OP is this OP is half of AB half of AP okay so this half comes here AP is the height of the trapezium let us denote it by H and BH is equal to AD AD plus BC and this is half height half height into AD is B plus BC is A or you can write this as just making the order here maintaining the order here A plus B you know F becomes F after A that's why therefore the area of the trapezium abbreviated by the trapezium symbol is this so we have the same conclusion as our previous video.